Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, Stevan here with All American Prince Supply with some big news. We're coming to you live from STS headquarters in beautiful Boca Raton, Florida, and I'm standing next to the all new Expert Jet 16A2D Industrial 64 inch direct to film printer. Make sure you guys stay tuned. We're gonna go over some of the awesome new upgrades and features, as well as take you through a start to finish demonstration. You guys ready? All right, for all my DTF printers, all the direct to film folk out there, you already know what step one's gonna be. We're gonna go ahead and remove the now standard one liter bulking bag system, and we're gonna agitate both of the two white inks. Now to do this properly, I'm gonna go ahead and secure the bag to the adapter, make sure nothing comes unhooked at the attachment point, and we're just gonna go back and forth like so. We do recommend one minute plus of agitation to make sure that nothing has settled. There's something about that white pigment. You just wanna make sure you get nice, good agitation, again, on both of the now standard one liter bulking bags. Step two is gonna to be to load our media into the 1628D. Thanks to the improved media flange, this step has never been easier. Capable of loading materials such as film, canvas, certain transfer vinyls, really any kind of aqueous material you can think of, this machine can handle it. Let's go ahead and lock this in. Just gonna place this into the housing like so. Take the media here, feed this through nice and easy. And once it's performed, we're gonna go ahead and grab this lever right here and lock the pinch rollers in place. After we've gone ahead and fed our film through the rear of the machine, locked the pinch rollers into place, it's time to secure the material fasteners. This is gonna serve a couple functions here. One, it's gonna allow the 1628D to detect the appropriate width of the media, which is also gonna tell the machine how much vacuum force to use. You don't want vacuum force applying on the entire area where we can print, we only really want it on the material itself. This is gonna preserve the life of the printhead by not exposing it to unnecessary vacuum suction. Additionally, this is also gonna feature three levels of media height detection, which is an improvement from the previous models too, for optimum printhead height placement. Let's lock in the film. This next step is probably one of my favorite features on the brand new ExpertJet 16A2D. We're gonna do an auto head alignment right now. Since it has a dual print head system, you wanna make sure your registration is perfect, especially with DTF printing. Let's take a look. All we're gonna do from our home screen is select setup by pressing the right arrow here. We're gonna select user type one. We're gonna press enter here. And we're gonna to go to print adjust. Press the right arrow, confirm. And now we're gonna go down to auto. Press the right arrow to confirm. We're gonna select all. And now we're ready to do our auto print head adjustment. All right, now that we got the media locked and loaded with the height and width and vacuum seal detected, it's time to do a quick nozzle check to make sure the first garment comes out perfect. From the home screen, all we're gonna do is press the left arrow and it's already gonna be highlighted on nozzle check. And to execute, you're just gonna go ahead and press the arrow button, which is the enter key. Wow, that was a fast nozzle check. Must be thanks to the new dual print head staggered setup with eight channels per head. Now that we've got our media locked and loaded, print head checked, it's time to feed the film into our powder applicator, shaker, conveyor dryer. Super easy. All we're gonna do is get the film and we're gonna feed it through to the other side, like so. And we wanna make sure we got enough film to get on the other side and we're gonna attach it to where the vacuum seal is over here. That's gonna keep the media locked in place and fed through nice and evenly. After we fed it through to the vacuum portion, we're just gonna hit fan on and we're locked and loaded. All right, now here we are in the Flexi 21 DTF Pro Edition RIP software. We've already got our job queued up right here, so we're just gonna double click and launch our job properties. Here we have our layout preview. We can see an image of what we're about to prepare. And thanks to the auto media width detection, all of our dimensions are already preloaded. From here, I can change my quantity, my sizing, really everything. Since we're ready to go, let's go ahead and send the job. The STS 1682D is truly the honestly, the only serious way to take your direct to film printing to an industrial level. Now, after the films are printed onto the fabric, we're gonna go ahead and have that fed into the automated powder applicator 
and shaker. And thanks to the vacuum seal that we set up in the beginning, it's gonna keep that nice and fresh and flush against the belt as it's fed into the conveyor dryer, which is then gonna produce for us on a take-up reel, fully cured and ready to apply, ready to store, or ready to sell heat transfers that we can apply to almost any material. We haven't even talked about safety yet. Take confidence, not only in your production staff, but also your customers of all ages, knowing that all supplies, materials, and equipment do come with Oecotech safety passports. Oecotech is a governing board of safety printing and protocols to ensure the well-being of, like I said, your print staff who's manufacturing your goods and your customers who are actually gonna be wearing them. And hopefully we wanna keep those guys sticking around for as long as possible. Now, what do we have here? This doesn't look like film. Are you telling me that all the Muto STS direct-to-film roll printers are capable of printing on canvas and vinyl? That's right, any aqueous receptive material, including photo paper, is all compatible with the direct-to-film printing system from Muto and STS. That's crazy. There's so many awesome features about this. We're really excited to offer this. We are taking pre-orders now. So be sure to head over to aprintsupplyco.com. You can connect with a friendly representative, answer any question you may have, and get on that waiting list. This machine is coming fall 2022, and we can't wait to get our hands on it. For more information, like I said, head over to the website, aprintsupplyco.com. If you haven't done so already, go ahead and hit that red subscribe button. Drop some thumbs up, and if you do have any questions or comments, you can leave that in the section below. My name is Esteban. We're coming to you from on-site STS Inks in Boca Raton, Florida. Thank you so much for joining us. We'll see you on the next one.